Good afternoon, everyone. Random Canuck here. It has been a very busy time for me as I am preparing uh, to head to the beautiful province of British Columbia. I don't know if you can see in behind me there, but uh, I got my stuff pretty much packed and ready to go. And yes, that is a BC Lions hat uh, that I think I should wear um, in that province so I don't get my butt whipped. A um, couple of little notes. Unfortunately, due to tra my travel schedule and the Kamloops Blazers store and arena hours uh, not really gelling, unfortunately, I won't be able to make it to the Kamloops Blazers arena, the Sandman Center, or the Kamloops Blazers store. I'm really bummed out about that. Reason being is my girlfriend and I are leaving Wednesday morning, but by the time we get there, uh, the store will pretty much be closed. And when we come through Kamloops on the way home, it's a Saturday and they're not open on uh, a Saturday and Sunday. And unfortunately, they're not open on the weekends. They're only open Monday to Thursday from like eight till three. So unfortunate, I won't be stopping by uh, the Blazers Arena, the Sandman Center. Um, I mean, I could just walk around or whatever, but I really wanted to go in, buy stuff, support the team. Um, I didn't really want to just show the outside. Um, I, I mean, things might change. I might just say, okay, let's just go do it if we have time. Uh, but unfortunately, that plan of getting some good video of the arena, inside the arena, um, and the stores is not going to work out. Um, but I want to thank the Blazers organization uh, for getting back to me in for with my questions and things. So um, that just means I'll have to come back another time to see a game uh, live during uh, the regular season. That's kind of the other issue uh, is I'm going in the off season. Like most of those places are shut down for the summer. But not to worry, I'm still well uh, uh, scheduled uh, to stop and visit the Victoria Royals Arena. I believe it's called the Save On Memorial Arena, Save On Foods Memorial Arena and get goodies from them uh, because when we're there, they're open and they're, they're ready to go. So um, I will be getting footage of that at least. So um, anyways, but that's not why I'm here. Why I'm here is to unbox some more hats uh, from my favorite hat brand, 47 brand hats. Uh, I decided to treat myself uh, and get some new hats. Um, I got three to show you. And these will uh, be a part of another video I'm going to do probably when I get back. Uh, but I am going to open this up and unbox this for you guys and show you what I got. Um, just want to be careful. These were supposed to come today and they did. I was, I ordered them on the 17th of July. Or no, sorry. I ordered them on the 7th of I don't know. I ordered them in time for them to get here. Oh, yeah, these are pretty. Okay, I'm just going to put this on the bottom. All right, we're going to start with... Okay, okay, they came right out of the wrap, but that's okay. Pull one out here. Arizona Coyotes. Yes, Arizona Coyotes, the NHL's ultimate underdog. Um, I was hoping there would be a green version in this, uh, but there isn't. It's only black. And you know what? That's fine. Um, I just really love this logo and the Arizona Coyotes are one of uh, the teams I, you know, kind of have a soft spot for. So I just thought I would get one of these. I'm just going to try this on. Got to at least try it on. And with my head pretty much shaved, I don't need to move this too much. There, that, I just love these hats. Like 47 brands, the best way to go, guys. They're, they're relatively uh, good price and everything. They're a Canadian brand. Um, they, I think they come out of Montreal or something like that, or definitely Quebec, I think is their headquarters. Um, yeah, I'll put the link in the video description so you too can, can, uh, get some hats for yourself. Oh yeah. And they're so comfy. And the best thing is I don't really care if these get wet or dirty cause they're not like, you know, $50 hats. I was going to get an Arizona Coyotes draft hat, but I thought, no, um, I mean, I love the little local store here in Sherwood Park, but not really spending that money. I got for, and then the Colorado Avalanche Stanley Cup Champions hat there was 50 bucks plus tax. I'm like, no way. I'm going to go to 47 brand, order myself a few hats. And I think the three hats that I got were close to, were close to the price of one. So 
no knock on the, the, the sports store where I shop here in Sherwood Park, but I just wasn't feeling paying those prices. I think I'll treat myself an order from 47 brand. Plus I get points towards uh, free hats so or money off my next purchase. So there's that. All right, next on the unboxing, the Baltimore Ravens. Yes, I went with the Baltimore Ravens. I, again, a soft spot and I like the color purple. Sue me. Uh, because I bought their Los Angeles Kings hat, their vintage one in purple, I thought might as well get the Baltimore Ravens. So I'm just going to, again, I, I just can't stress enough how easy these are to adjust. Like, it's so great. This one might still be too tight, but let's try it. Well, that's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. I just don't have it tucked in. So there we go. Baltimore Ravens. Love it. The purple and gold. It's it's lighter, actually. It's kind of a lighter gold and a lighter purple. I actually like that. So this is great. I was hoping they were going to have a purple one in this, but they didn't. Uh, they only had black. So I'm like, well, that's fine. Um, I have a purple LA Kings one, like I said. So um, I'm just going to do this back up again and try that. That's a bit too small. I will fiddle with this off camera. So there we go. And finally, the third hat, the Ottawa Senators. Now, I know a lot of you are probably thinking, well, Random Canuck, you hate the color red. Kind of over that now. It was mostly due to another reason I won't say on camera. But um, yeah, I decided to get the Ottawa Senators. And I got to tell you, I am starting to like the Ottawa Senators more and more as a favorite team. I'm telling you, um, <laughs> the way that they were able to get to Brinkett, they got Kachuk wrapped up. They got Cam Talbot. They got uh, Claude Giroux. I'm telling you, these aren't going to be your old, cheap Ottawa Senators anymore. This team's going to be really, really good down the road um, if all things go well to plan. Oh, yeah, so comfortable. I love this. There we go. Ottawa Senators right there. 47, 47 brand, cleanup caps. Go get them. Support a Canadian uh, company. They're well priced. Um, let me just get my bill here, and I'll just. Um, I don't know if it'll have the price. It doesn't have the price. Does it? Doesn't have the price, but. Um, um, yeah. So th these are called the they're the N NFL and NHL cleanup hats. So those are the kinds I get. Um, I ordered this on the 11th of July. So. And it got here before I went to BC, so I'm really happy about that. Um, I'm just going to go on to my Shopify here real quick just to tell you how much those were. And I do plan on getting one more for these guys for my... Okay, so each hat was $34.99 for a total of $110.22, where one hat at a certain place was $50. It, I, I, I just, I'm not, I, I just can't argue facts. So there you have it. I'll put the link in the channel description. Go to 47brand.ca and uh, go get yourself some hats. So we've got Baltimore Ravens, Ottawa Senators, and the Arizona Coyotes. There we go, right there. Uh, go, go and support a Canadian team. Get yourself some, uh, buy at least one Canadian team hat. I like to have, so I got Vancouver and I got Ottawa, I got Quebec Nordique, so... Um, I do want to order a Montreal Canadiens one next because they're starting to pull at my heartstrings again too. Montreal's weird. My uncle is a Habs fan and I, I love him, hate him, but now the way the direction the team's going, they got one of my favorite players in the NHL now, Kirby Doc. so I think I'm going to start pulling for Montreal a little more. Plus, I am the Random Canuck, so I have to like as many Canadian teams, right? Anyways, this has been the Random Canuck. I think, I'm hoping I have one more video for you guys. Uh, for another unboxing that's coming tomorrow, hopefully it could come today. So stay close to the channel because it could have another video could happen today, but for sure tomorrow. And after that, I'm off to BC, so there won't be any videos uh, coming on the channel till about August first or second. So uh, thank you so much for watching. We'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.